Today we're having a look at a new bag from Boog and it's called the Python Top Loader. And this is ideal for going out on those day trips when you don't want to take a large bag full of camera gear. But what can this bag actually hold? You've got a double zip on the top here which gives a little bit of security on there and it's ideal for a small compact DSLR camera. Nothing too big. This is a four-thirds camera. You can put our lens hood in there and the camera itself. But there's more to this bag. At the top here, we've got room for putting small accessories in there, such as cable releases, etc. But at the bottom here, we have a secret compartment where we can fit in an extra couple of small lenses. Now, if you want to put a 300mm lens in there or something longer, it won't work. It's only small lenses here. At the side, we've got some pouches here where we can put extra memory cards in, uh, both sides there. Um, it's okay, not a lot of room in there. In fact, you won't get your sandwiches in here either. At the top here, we've got a, a number plate on here. Now, if you register your bag with boog.com, they will know your number on there. So if your bag goes missing and somebody hands it in, they'll know exactly who the bag, complete with contents, belongs to. So you'd have to be very lucky for somebody handling in this. At the side here, we've got a couple of compartments here. One, we can put uh, accessories like spirit level in or car keys, uh, more memory cards, batteries, etc. It's not a lot of room in there. It's actually quite tight in actual fact. But on the other side, we also have a secondary bag here where we can put things like a mobile phone, more memory cards. In fact, you'll be carrying around lots of memory cards with this bag. It's totally waterproof on there, so we will protect your bag on a rainy day. At the top here, we've got a convenient carrying strap on there. Plus also, the actual shoulder strap is made from the same material as car safety belts. So this isn't likely to be falling off your shoulder or breaking very easily. Overall, the construction is very robust. It's been very well made. There's a lot of attention to detail on the bag. You're going to have to check out the Boog.com website to see what the pricing is in your area. All in all, I'd say it's really good, but I would have preferred something slightly bigger, so I could have packed in a few more accessories and possibly a few more lenses.